All right, hey now, how's everybody doing today? Today I'm going to be doing a quick tutorial on how to upload your custom liveries from ACC onto Awesome Sim Racing. Had a bunch of people in a bunch of different groups on Discord asking how to do this, so I figured I would just make a quick tutorial on how to do it. So let's get to it. Uh, first thing you want to do is go to the Awesome Sim Racing website, which is alpha.awesome-simracing.com. And once you're there, this is assuming that you have a Discord. Uh, you're going to go up to the top right where it says Login. And you're going to hit the Login Register via Discord. And you're going to authorize it. And here it loads up my communities. Okay, anything that, any group that you're a part of on Discord, that also has a awesome sim racing website uh, account sorry uh, that will populate here so these are all the groups that you can get the custom deliveries from so in some cases you may already have uh, an awesome account and you already logged in and you join a new discord group and you go to sync deliveries from that group and you don't see it here in the communities um, what you'll need to do is log out and log back in again, and it'll refresh your all your accounts. So anyway, um, on the right side, I'm going to click on my liveries because I'm going to be uploading a livery that I did for a guy I know. I uh, threw together a quick um, Porsche livery for him. So we're going to add custom ACC livery. And in the title, we are going to call this uh, Golf Porsche. I can type. Uh, this is for Mr. McKay. Um, the car is a Porsche 991-2 GT3, and they have it mislabeled here. It's not a 911, it's a 991, but I believe that is the right car. So you're going to select your car from that drop down, and you're going to come down here. And this is what starts scrambling people's brains. Um, we'll just name it. Uh, just name a golf Porsche. Some of this stuff does seem kind of redundant. Actually, I'll just name it McKay. Golf Porsche McKay. Okay, so once that's done, now you're going to come down here and choose your liveries. So you're going to click Choose File. And I'm already up on here, but if we come back to the main here, Files are going to be in Documents, Set of Course of Competizione, Customs, and then Liveries. And then you're going to scroll through your list of liveries, and I've got a bunch, as you can see. There's a ton of them in here. Um, and I'm going to use the McKay Golf and then one, two. So I'm going to double click on that, and now you have two, two options here. So now you just want to be careful and make sure you're putting the right the right file in the right place. So this is asked for the decals. So you're just going to double click on decals and it's going to upload it for you. Now, the decals underscore one is you're going to make sure that you have made your livery and just taken it out on track. You don't need to actually race it. You just need to load it up. As soon as you load up into the uh, pit lane, you can cancel out your game because that will create your underscore one. And there's also an underscore zero that'll be in there, and that's created as soon as you make your livery and open it up in uh, when you select your car. As soon as you load it onto the onto the car in the game, it creates that underscore zero. So we're gonna hit choose file, and now these are the files that you should have in there. You should have your sponsors and your decals JSON. These are gonna be your paint values, and then here's the underscore zero. This is the sponsors and the decals. That's the one that's created as soon as you open it up in the showroom. And the underscore one is going to be the ones that are created as soon as you take it out on track. So this is asking for the underscore one for the decals. So we're just going to double click that. And now you're going to upload your decals JSON. And now do the same thing for your sponsors. Looking for your sponsors. Click that. And the underscore one. And the JSON. Okay, so now you don't want to go down and, and hit save. You don't need to do that yet. Now you're going to come in here and 
select whoever made this for you or if it was yourself or someone else okay now you could put the links and all that but if you just made this yourself this is just to give credit to whoever did it it's a cool thing to do you know don't be that guy that's a dick and just takes credit for everything even if you didn't do it um so you're gonna click myself and then you're gonna hit showcase and this is if you want it to show up like I'm uploading this into my own account so I'm gonna hit show so that people can see it um, it's just gonna put an image there and then the media I just took a screenshot of it and so see these are some of the ones that I've done before uh, I'm gonna choose the file and I just saved this on my desktop and I think it was just uh, where did I put that at? Of Porsche McKay. All right. And now this old, after this old spinning guy is done. Okay. So now it's there. So you need to put an alternative text in here for whatever reason. So I'm just going to put Golf Porsche. Um, description you don't need to put. This is just marked with the little red star here, so you have to do that. Any of the other stuff I don't do. Okay, so now this part you do have to save. So now you can select it over here. So now there's the image that I just uploaded. I'm going to insert the selected. And there it's set. Okay, so now you're going to hit publishing. And the author is myself, authored on. Uh, yeah, it's not the right time, but it's whatever. Okay, so now hit save. And there you are. So now I can add this to a livery collection. And any of the groups that I'm a part of, I can just, so, okay, so if I want to say just do that. It'll put the big old check mark there. You just hit select collection and it will add it to that. So this would be for if you're a member of a group and they're having a league races and you want other people that are using the awesome sim racing app, they'll be able to see your livery once you add it to the collection. Hope that makes sense. Um, now you have to be careful because some of these groups have like uh, the SRA, the Sim Racers Alliance, they have Division 1, Season 5, Division 2, Season 4. Now they've marked this legacy. And then you have Division 2, Season 5. So you just make sure you put it into the right group. So for instance, uh, Sim Seniors. I believe they only have one group right now. Let's go, let's go look. Is some seniors? Am I just not seeing it here? Okay, see they. This is their logo. It's uploads, but it just says uploads. So you just have to. Okay, so there it is. So the the sub. It's the open. So this will be all of them, and then here's their group. So for instance, if I wanted to do some seniors, I would just click it. And you can only do one group at a time. So if, now that the other ones I've see if one uploads here, but if I click this, it moves away from there. So don't think you can just go through and select all the ones that you want to upload it to and hit, you know, select collection and it's going to go there. So you would just click that and then hit select collection and upload it. But um, mine is already in my old man sim racing. So I don't think it's going to allow me to do it again. Yeah, see, it's already there, but you would just hit upload, and, and as opposed to replace, I'll just hit replace, and it's there. That simple. And you hit X. Go back to home. My account, and here's my livery. Really that simple. But you guys have any questions, leave them below. If this helped you out at all, make sure you like and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. It's a new channel. I'm just trying to get some uh, more viewers. So help me out a little bit. And until next time, see you on track.